Family members of those on board the ill-fated MH370 have surrendered five new pieces of debris believed to be part of the Malaysia Airlines aircraft which went missing in 2014. The relatives passed the items which had been found washed ashore in Madagascar to Transport Minister Anthony Lok at the ministry on Friday. One of the next of kin, Grace Northern, had urged the government not to close down any chance to search for the missing aircraft. I think the fact that debris is still washing up now, it means that this investigation is still live. It shouldn't be closed because, you know, there's still evidence washing up. So why should we turn a blind eye to evidence that is washing up on the shores of Africa? And, and there are parties, private companies with that are capable, who are willing to continue searching on a no-cure, no-fee basis, I think we should be more open to allowing them to do the search. Lok said the government has not totally shut down on the idea of resuming the search for MH370. We have never closed down any possibilities. Yes. If there are any credible leads, then anybody who can give us some credible leads, after we uh, dis after discussion, if we, our authorities think that there's a credible lead, then we are always prepared to reopen. The five pieces of debris were found on three different locations in Madagascar between December 2016 and August 2018. They were all found by villagers and local fishermen. Also present at the handover was amateur investigator Blaine Gibson, who had been conducting his own searches for clues relating to MH370. Gibson said one of the significant pieces of debris was believed to be a floor panel of a Boeing 777, which was found last year near Sandra Vinani in southern Madagascar. Is the floor panel, and that is a small fractured piece of the passenger cabin floor panel of a Boeing 777. So that tells us something, because if the floor actually fractured, that tells us that this plane really shattered and there's not an intact fuselage underwater. Flight MH370 was on its way from Kuala Lumpur to Beijing on March 8, 2014 with 239 people on board when it disappeared and became one of the world's greatest aviation mysteries. Malaysian and international investigators believe the jet veered thousands of miles off course from its scheduled route before eventually plunging into the Indian Ocean. In all, 27 pieces of aircraft debris have been collected from various places around the world, but only three wing fragments that washed up along the Indian Ocean coast have been confirmed to be from MH370, according to Reuters.